starvation, your baby crying, can't feed the baby, you know, your woman is uh, getting changed, you brain break for a million. <laughs> you know, that's that's true though, because Judah's got, is supposed to have that uh, kingly spirit, right. that's the, the head tribe. So, when Israel get punished, they always going to get the worst of the punishment. You know what I mean? That, that's just the way it works. You know what I'm saying? Because they, they supposed to be the leaders of Israel, so they got, you know what I'm saying? That's just how the spirit did them. That's why they suffered the worst of the slavery of all the tribes. They do, don't they? <laughs> right, right. It, it, he's like, I'm a home man. Right, right. I don't follow nobody. Also, history starts to tell us that the best thing is Probably true. Like, uh, Moses, uh, right? Yeah. Well, King David, he was a, a tribe of Judah. Originally, the first king was from the tribe of Benjamin. Yeah. But, but King David still respected Saul, though. He didn't seek to overthrow Saul. To seek, even though Saul was being wicked, King David still respected the order and the authority. He didn't seek to overthrow him. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, it, it, it's where he likes Scarface when he, uh, when he was coming up against him. Oh, that's later in the Book of Kings. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when he was coming up against him, what's the dude on the car line? Oh, I'm like, I never crossed you. I mean, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do my, make my own money or whatever. I never crossed you. <laughs> Scarface crazy. That's bullshit. They ain't loyal to shit. Oh, I got Al Pacino. Uh, oh, he the mic though. Right, right, right. Yeah, he the right. Damn crack. <laughs> and still, Scarface still didn't kill him. He told Ben Yendo. Whatever the other motherfucker do, his right hand man killed. <laughs> he gonna do it himself. That's a yeah. Some people ain't got these days of respect and shit. Respect for order, respect for authority. Right, right. That goes back to the what? The Lord said the two greatest commandments is the what? To to love the Most High and to love your brother as thyself. That's really the two. Uh, when you say the Lord's Prayer, what do you say? Uh, forgive me my debts and forgive the brother of his debts. You know what I'm saying? Or your sins. So, because that's the first thing said. Well, how's it go? Uh, our Father which art in heaven. Hey, let's get that. Uh, I, I even had him on touch you. Oh, but you know, because you know how you do it. Because it's actually said two different ways in the Bible. Because is. You don't know, have to say exact word for word. It is what you're saying in the prayer. That's right. You know what I mean? The things that you ask for. The main thing that you should be asking for is that the kingdom come. Yeah, that's the number one priority. If you understood what it's a system, then they're about to be out here. Yeah. All of these will be out here, man. Be excited. No, no, no. They're blind. Let me like, get that, right, man. Let's get this kingdom popping. Hey, get that. Uh, let's get that first. Because really, you know, the Lord's Prayer is the truth boiled down the one prayer. This is the essence of the whole truth is in the Lord's Prayer. Go ahead. Matthew 7. This is, uh, 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 this is, u
Because five minutes before it's going to be discovered by the time, it's going to be too late, man. It really is. You know, we're warning you. We're showing you mad love, man. You know, because I don't want to see you suffer, man. You know what I mean? And that's what the Lord's going to do. He's going to make sure two-thirds of people suffer, man. They're going to feel that bite, bro. They're going to feel it, man. You guys see how it be. It's a light look on our anger. This is the most important thing anybody could be doing on this planet Earth right now. I'm talking about this whole fucking giant Earth of 8 billion plus people, man. It's what we're doing right now. But since you can't, people can't spiritually see it, can't see at the end of the tunnel what's, what's, what they're leaving, man, they, in the world. Man. You don't want to waste your life on a bunch of foolish shit anyway, man. Because right, right. like the scriptures say, well, your life is like a vapor. You know what I mean? It's like, it ain't nothing to it. You know what I'm saying? It's like you only here before, but in this life, you only here for a moment. Life is not long at all. So you better not be wasting your time doing some bullshit. Right, right. Right. Huh? Go ahead, read this. Uh, Ephesians 5 and 16. It said, no, sorry, it said uh, see then that you walk circumspectly, not as fools, but hey, hey, That's the spirit. He just said that. You got to walk circumspect. That means circle. You get a circle. Spec, where you get spectacles. You know what I mean? You just, to look all around you. You got you you to be looking around. Be aware of your surroundings. Be aware of what's going on in the news, of politics, there's a history, storm coming. everything, right? There's, there's a storm, storm coming, man. Yeah, we the there's West. a storm of storms coming. Well, we, we the meteor we, we meteorologists. We're the meteorologists. Babylon is falling. Right. Babylon is falling. Right. 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 It's falling. It's falling. Uh, it has right. become the habitation of the devil. The angels are stopping with that loud voice. Yeah. yeah. Babylon, right Babylon is falling. It's Give falling. Give her uh, the eye of the storm. Yeah. That's where we're at now. Yeah. That's where we're at now. Everybody, oh, happy everybody going to the store, buying a little, you know, death, 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 they started to bite each other now, man. That snake they've been playing with day by day, they've been smoking weed with that snake, it's, it's biting them. They're starting to bite each other now. Yeah, that's why uh, automobiles are built with locks on the doors. Houses have locks on the doors. What's up, question? Everything got you guys, locks. You guys know I do IT. What if that particular part of my life is the only thing that's keeping me away We're from We're good. Snake? That's good. That's good, though. I feel you. I feel you there. But at the same time, you still have a responsibility. Your number one responsibility is this. That's it, man. There's nothing wrong with having a job right. and stuff. Of course, you gotta do something. Everybody do something to keep their sanity, yes. man. You gotta, you better do something. You better do something. Do like me, like me. I, I like to sit and drink and read. I sit and drink and read. <laughs> you do a lot of stuff. Well, you know, I'm just being silly, but I do, though. We're, we're, not, we're, though. Not, we're not like uh, brain dead zombies, yeah. bro. We yeah. do stuff. Yeah. Work out. We're musicians. Working out. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be programming a computer. That takes time to learn this shit. You know what I mean? Yeah. 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 How long? Simple. He loves to listen. The story is the light of the story. Hate knowledge. Yeah, people, our, our people hate knowledge, man. I don't know why, but I just know why. Right, right. The knowledge is beautiful though. Like when you learn something you in the computers and stuff. That's some good, you know, the average person don't even want to learn about computers. Boy, there's some fine vibes that should have wrapped your mind around. What I was saying though is the average person, they, they don't understand, but once you learn something, you feel so good about right, yourself. Right. You know what I mean? Share right, you want to share it? As I think about it, Right. <laughs> now we build in a house. And like when, whenever I build, whenever I work with my hands, I promise it just, it's nirvana to me. I just, I heard that. I feel you. That's what we're doing. We build it. We're, uh, we're, we're brick layers. Oh, what's up, my man? Right? Candy man. Check out. I know oh, you got so something for me. Yeah. You got the light. You got, you got, got the light. lights on this shit and everything. I, I got lights on mine too. I do too. I just bought some new lights. I just bought some new ones. That is a big one. That's good for your knees. <laughs> hey, let's get that Lord's Prayer while they do it. Go ahead. You got to take care of business. You got to get that good stuff. Matthew 6 and 9. After the marriage, therefore pray, you, our Father which art in heaven. Our, our Father which art in heaven. 
Go ahead. I will be thy name. And everybody knows this prayer, but they oh. don't know it. You know what I mean? They don't realize the magnitude of the words they say when they say this prayer. They say it all the time at church. They say the AA meetings and all that. They don't understand what they say when they say this prayer. But read that again. After this manner, therefore pray ye, our Father which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. All right, so like right there. It says, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. So when you say in the Lord's Prayer, you praying to the Lord that his kingdom comes. And so when the Lord's kingdom comes, there ain't going to be no more America, no more UK. You know what I'm saying? None of these other co countries are going to exist. When you when you praying for the Lord's kingdom to come, you you, you what? Go ahead. Yeah, you praying that America gets destroyed, right? That's my older brother. You might as well. If you want to say something, bro, you can speak. You got anything to say? You know what I'm saying? Because America's going to be destroyed, and that 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 goes hand in America being destroyed goes hand in hand with the, the Lord's prayer. That's the, the kingdom can't come till this kingdom's destroyed. There ain't gonna be no America in parallel with the uh, kingdom of heaven. You know what I mean? Go ahead. It's like, it's like you. I got. But that's like when your grandma says the Lord's prayer, your auntie or whatever. She don't understand it when she says it. My grandma's dead. I'm not just talking. I'm just talking to the world. You know what I'm saying? But uh, when, when, when all these old people, you know these old good Christians. They, they don't know, they don't know nothing. They love America. They think America's a beautiful place. I've but they, but they saying the Lord's Prayer though. Don't say that. Huh? I've never heard anyone in my family say that. Oh, that's good. Well, I'm just saying the average person. You know what I'm saying. Matter of fact, everybody want to get the fuck out Put it this way. Donald Trump's wife, you see uh, Donald Trump's wife, she said the Lord's Prayer. Now, Donald Trump campaigned under the slogan what? Make America Great Again. But they said the Lord's Prayer at a rally. That's fact. <laughs> Damn. I don't even know that though. This Damn. dude brought so much that. <laughs> wow, that's diabetes. So, like, that's some beatus right there, boy. Wait till I had that beatus. What? The fuck? He done came up. Since the boss said that people come, right? So since you know, since you know that in your head, you should know like, what should, what should I do? Should I prepare myself? Should I just fuck off and sit on the computer all day? Watch porn, whatever the fuck you do, me. I'm not saying you. I'm just saying. I mean, it's a, it's, it's a, alright, bro. It's a self time. Okay, okay. okay. You have to we, we, know, we know how it works. It's not as major. <laughs> okay, okay. We all have the internet. Let me change the subject. Pretty much, what I'm saying is, the Lord said is, you gotta, you gotta pray yourself. And since the Lord said that kingdom come, that means he gotta destroy this place first. It's gotta go. And if it gotta destroy, and you in here, you in here, right? So if. If destruction's coming here, that should put you in some, some type of fear, like, oh shit, wait a minute. This is about to get nuked, so what the fuck should I do? That's so why, I'm gonna get nuked. That's why we out here. You gotta fear yourself. So I, I, I be fearing, bro. I know if I miss a day out here teaching, and I just fall, I'm gonna take a month off. We'll I'm, make you feel guilty anyway. Oh, yeah, they, no, nah, <laughs> I already know they would make a 12 part YouTube series <laughs> on me. Nah, we would do all that. Well, I already if you miss one day, We'll just clown a little bit, but if you didn't fall out, <laughs> that's why I say if I fell if out, just stop falling, if, if I fell off, everybody make videos about me. That's what we've done right. to other people right. that fell out. Right. You know? That's that fear. I don't want that content. I don't want it that. Con that heavy place, heavy on your content. I don't feel good, man. Yeah, I, I like to sleep, man. I enjoy this too much. I anyway. like sleeping. Right. I like being able to sleep. You don't, you don't pray for like a good time, like, like a couple hours, you feel all weird and shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So we constantly like, fear. Like, I'd be constantly asking myself sometimes, am I falling out of the truth? You know what I mean? You're examining yourself. You're examining yourself. Like, you're examining yourself. Like, am, I, am I just a big piece of shit, ain't I? That's that, what I be that, thinking. That demon of doubt is around everybody yeah. now. We in the, because we get closer to the end. That demon of doubt be fucking with your head, man. Fucking yeah, with does. your heavy, it man. It fucks with, that's the biggest, Ooh. that's the heaviest spirit of them all. Yep. You know? Your enemy is you, man. You sit that mirror yep. in front of you, you seen your worst enemy, man. That's true. Your man. damn self, man. Because we in these fleshy, wicked ass, sinful bodies, man. We go always look sick for Jesus. Sick ass, weak flesh, man. You try hard to be perfect, then you yeah. do some dumb ass shit. Yeah. Let's read Romans, man. Romans, Paul speaks about the flesh, man. How weak, you know, how weak it can get, man. An Israelite, man. He's a witness. Yeah. You know? Well, trust me, man. These temptations in the Lord's hey. Prayer, what we're talking about. Yeah, go to the day. Yeah. lead me not into yeah. temptation. Yeah. Lead me not into temptation, but deliver me from evil. You know what I mean? These 
Right, I just had a I had this fucking on my I had this uh bars, the bars and twelve. You could have a married married bitch trying to hit hit you up. Yeah, like like yeah, yeah, come yeah. on baby, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. She look good as hell. Yeah. You ain't had no pussy in a minute yeah. and a married yeah. a fine ass married woman trying to get with you. That's yeah. that temptation. Right. You gotta have the strength to say no. Yep. But she still gave him the number, you know? That's okay. ten, that's that temptation, man. Right. So and in the deal? and you gonna have that demon in your mind, like it's okay, man. Yep, 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 yep. I was like, I was like, yep. baby, it's over. Like, let's go. Let's see it. All right, man. And I'm trying you, to go get some. And then some dudes might lie to themselves and be like, well, looking at the grass right now. He, she ain't with a man of the Lord, so it's okay. Yeah, right, right. That's not what the world's in. Yeah. <laughs> the Nate nasty Nate deal. I don't give a damn if she she's married to a devil worshiper. Yeah, like Edomite, an Edomite, an Edomite, Edomite. Edomite. like uh, like Serena Williams. Yeah. <laughs> that bitch pregnant too. Oh uh, shit, Serena Williams is pregnant by a devil, man. It's crazy. And we're gonna, we're gonna she's see. pregnant by him. Man. We'll find out when they grow. Uh, <laughs> Serena Williams is pregnant by him. Oh uh, shit, <laughs> he got a fine ass. Uh, How's it feel to be married to Serena Williams? <laughs> he, got one. he do, he's like, he like a <laughs> He turned right as hell when he said that. <laughs> you see his walk back? Yeah, he's like, hold on, hold on. Yeah, right, 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 right. This is kingdom, man. He don't drop the world, man. What can we say bad to him? Yeah, because y'all have somebody justify that in the mind. They'd be like, oh, she would have eaten my anyway. It's cool if I just did that. Yeah. Okay, that's yeah, wicked. That's wicked. That, that, that's like you got people try to justify it's okay uh, stealing from a heat. You know what I mean? Yeah, he, he ain't supposed to be stealing from nobody. No problem. Maybe the heat. Hell no. Stealing the thou shalt not steal. This world ain't got shit that's worth it. And actually, you look in the Old Testament, the Most High, they had Joshua conquering all the Canaanites, and he said, don't take none of that gold. Ooh. And then one of the Israelites took some anyway, and he got put to death for it. You ain't supposed to be, you're supposed to be, uh, we're supposed to be setting the example. We're supposed to be a light to the other nations of how to live. Because the heathens, they're the ones that steal from everybody. You that's know right, what I'm saying? That's right. They can never have enough. They never have enough. I can, uh, go ahead with the rest. Let me get that. That's like Isaiah. Then Isaiah 2, all the well, nations are going to learn the law from us. I had me some lovely long time. Thirsting for uh, riches. Oh, hold up. I got a precept for that. Yeah, you ain't out here. I mean, it's cool if you got a good job or whatever. There's nothing wrong with, you know, having a good business and not making money. That'd be the Lord's blessing for you, you know what I mean? But, uh. No, right here. Uh, Proverbs 16 and 16. How much better is it to get wisdom than gold? And to get understanding, rather to be chosen than silver. You know give what I'm me, saying? Give me twelve silver. <coughs> twelve. Uh -oh. oh, come on, man. This guy right here. Oh, that's his girl. But yeah, so that's why the Lord. Just for the camera, though. That's why you're supposed to ask for your daily bread, man. Because the because the real food and real riches anyway is a, is a, the knowledge. You know what I'm saying? The wisdom. And that's all we get anyways, our daily bread. It's over. It's over. We got a whole week's worth of shit. She ain't get no daily bread. Yeah. Oh shit, Daryl. Daryl! What the fuck? <laughs> the hell? Uh, we were just talking about you, man. What's up, man? Man, I just came back from Pittsburgh, man. Yeah. I've been there for a while. Right, right. What's up, brother? What's up, brother? What's up, brother? How y'all doing, doing, man? With you, man? Oh, man. How y'all doing, man? Yeah, my Y'all just rapping with somebody that work with you, man. I do, man, in the truck. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, you still working there? Yeah, I'm still there. Yeah. Yeah. He's broken so, back yet? Not much. I had my little brother for the first time. <laughs> yeah, mom, back in the day, he was my first time. Yeah, right. Yeah, she's very good. She's 51. Yeah, she's going to be a 
Hey, look, that's the spirit. He come out here today. I talked to Dave earlier today. I just, just got off the Greyhound, too. Wow, wow. You still out west? Yeah, on the west side, yeah. Hell yeah. Don't <laughs> <laughs> have a thought up. Hell no. I think that's a snacks. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah snacks little girl getting big, man. Little girl getting big, bro. Oh, she oh, growing up now? Yeah. The family going to just rack it up. Yeah, they I ain't going to do it. I do. See my little brother. That was it. See my grandma. And he always was in this room? With my little brother? Yeah. How yeah. oh, old is he? 15. Damn. He's a Viking warrior. <laughs> he look like he about to run through a whole fucking troop. Oh shit, the lumberjack man. That's the lumberjack. That's fucking Thor right there. <laughs> look like he walk, you know he a J. Look like he walk like he about to knock somebody out. He like, don't fuck with me, man. <laughs> he kind of like a double edged axe. He gonna hit you with a spike club. <laughs> I'm going to take care of the party. 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 I'm going
Yeah, that's why yeah, how was Charles? Hey baby. <laughs> that's the meaning of life pretty much. Glory, uh, riches. Yep. This ain't life right here. Glory, yeah, like Tupac glory, said, this ain't living. You know what I'm saying? It's Luke 24 and 44. And he said unto them, These are the words which I spake unto you while I was yet with you. That all things must be fulfilled which were written in the law of Moses and in the prophets and in the Psalms concerning you. You see, you see that? Oh, Read that again. Hold on. Okay. Say Oh, hopefully they beat the hell out of the bus. Oh, Are they sniffing them? Oh, no. That's because we live in a police state. It's your boy. Because you don't touch my Bible, boy. Uh, he said, nope, I'm not. Yeah. I'm sort of crying a couple weeks ago because I won't let him touch my Bible, man. You remember that guy, don't you? Dude, the 54 show right here. Chicago Bears show. Oh, that's oh, a love. Real. That's the yeah. love of Jesus right there. Yeah, love of Jesus. I remember that guy. <laughs> I'm supposed funny. to let him touch my Bible. Yeah, I'm gonna let my name touch my Bible. I'll be damned. I still can't. I can't even let him. Do I don't that. even never touch your Bible. <laughs> right, 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 right. You ever go out the street like, let me see your Bible? Yeah, right, right. Hey, bro, we see you. 